This is about to be one of the realest videos I ever made. No cap. Because I'm seeing a lot of shit, and I'm taking in a lot of downloads. And I'm going to be real with you, man. If you're still making excuses by the end of this year, just unsubscribe to my channel. If you still making excuses by the end of the, by the end of 2020, unsubscribe from my channel. I truly mean that shit. Because it's like, what are you doing? What are you doing, bruh? Okay, maybe last year you could get away with saying you had school. You're too busy. You had a job. You're working a full-time job. You don't got enough time. Maybe last year I would have gave you that. Maybe last year I would have believed that shit. But what's your excuse now, bro? For the past however many months, what have you been doing? I know niggas that have been literally been getting money from the government. I know people that have literally been on unemployment, bro. The government has been handing y'all money. And not even, honestly, the, the average amount of unemployment. Some of y'all been getting, like, that little bonus. Uh, so you've been getting a lot. So you haven't had to work. You haven't had to do shit. So what are you doing? Why can't you start that YouTube channel that you've always been wanting to start? Why can't you go write that book that you've always been wanting to write? Why can't you go lose that 30 pounds that you've been trying to lose for, for the past two years? Why can't you do it? Fuck it. Why can't you get on semen retention? Like, I don't understand it, bruh. At this point, you just making excuses. You just making excuses, bruh, and you feeling sorry for yourself, and I don't respect it. I don't respect it because there's actually people out there who's really going through shit. Who's really going through shit. But yet, they still, looking at, they still look at life with optimism. They're still optimistic about life. Meanwhile, you you feeling sorry for yourself because you can't you don't got a girlfriend. You feeling sorry for yourself because you can't find the one. Man, fuck, man, fuck the one, bruh. Fuck that bullshit, bro. How the fuck you sitting up here? How the fuck you sitting up here worried about a girlfriend and you ain't even got your shit together? You can't even drive, my nigga. You don't even have a car. You don't even have a job. You can't even stop beating your meat. You can't even stop watching porn and you trying to sit here and have a girlfriend. You want your girl to be bad. You want a 10. You can't handle her, bruh. I'm going to be real with you. If a lot of y'all got a 10 right now, you would get cheated on tomorrow. She would cheat on you tomorrow. She would break your heart. And you would be in your room depressed for the rest of 20. For the rest of this coronavirus, you would be depressed. You would not come out your room. You would be sick. Because you can't handle it, bruh. Fuck is you doing? Why are you still making excuses? I don't understand it. I don't understand it. A lot of y'all going back to school and shit. Bro, I'm going to go ahead and give y'all, I'm going to go ahead and tell y'all the trick for the trade, bro. The point of this whole shit is to distract you, is to keep you distracted. Is to keep you distracted. That's the point of the whole shit. That's why they, that's why they, they, they set you, they set this shit up from the beginning. They want you to sit here and go to college and get an average job and work a nine to five for the rest of your life. So you, you, you working five, six, seven days a week. You know what I'm saying? And you have no time to, to work on yourself. You have no time to work on your spirituality. That's what they want. They want you to work a job to where you have no time to work on yourself. They want you to be as distracted as possible. You can't see through this shit. They want you to be distracted as possible, bruh. They want you to be. And a, a lot of y'all, y'all following, right following right in the trap. I don't, bruh, I... Phew. Us YouTubers, man, we really trying to literally wake y'all up, literally tell y'all what it is. And you still following the rat trap. You still following the trap. Why? Because you scared. So you don't believe in the universe then. You don't trust the universe. If you scared, that's what you're saying. If you scared, you're saying you don't trust God. Because last, last time I hear niggas walking around talking about some, I only fear God. I only fear God. How the fuck you only fear God, but you can't take risk. But you're not out here jump, taking risk. Because you're scared to fail. So you don't only fear God. Stop telling that lie. You fear, you, you fear everything but God. A lot of you niggas fear everything but God. You fear everything but the universe, bruh. Come on, bro. They literally want y'all to be distracted so you can never work on yourself. You can never get to your high potential. If you work in a 9 to 5 every single day, when do you have time to meditate? When do you have time to go from within? Because by the time you get home from work, you're going to sleep. And then, oh, let's not even talk about when you start having kids, when you start building a family, then you're really going to be distracted. Then you really ain't going to have no time. Because you're going to be working a nine to five, plus trying to take care of your kids, and then you got to go to sleep. And then you got to get your rest. So when do you have time, my nigga? That's why we trying to wake y'all up now. That's why we trying to get this in your head right now, bro. That's why the universe has literally given you these past couple of months to work on yourself. Some, bro, some of y'all have not been doing shit, bro. 
You haven't been doing shit. You haven't been playing. You haven't. Ain't no games coming out. Trust me. Trust me. Ain't no. Ain't no video games coming out. Xbox, PlayStation, that shit been dead for a minute right now, bro. Game companies, they coming out with the same damn games. So don't use that. Don't use that as an excuse. You saying you working? You saying you going to school? How you going to school? All the classes online. You literally get your work in advance, my nigga. The class is online. How you fail an online class? Like, you have no excuse, bro. I don't want to hear this shit, bro. Every excuse you make, I promise you, I'll knock that shit down. You have no excuses. You have no excuses, bro. This is your time, honey. The universe wants to see you succeed. It literally is giving you this time so you can succeed. Go from within and find your purpose right now. Do not wait till the, do not wait till the food shortage comes. Don't wait till till um something some celebrity dies on Instagram and then the whole fucking world is sad again. Don't wait till that shit, bro. Stop waiting till something bad happens and get on your shit. You have no no excuse whatsoever. I don't want to hear it, bro. I don't want to hear it. Because there's people out there who really have excuses and they don't make excuses. There's people out there who, like I said, they sleep on cement every night. And they don't even make excuses about life. They the most optimistic people you can meet. I know some homeless people who who, who are, are more optimistic about life than niggas who got millions, bruh. I know, I know niggas who make, you know, make $100,000 a year who are just upset about life. They just, they just feeling sorry about life. Because they're not happy. You know why they're not happy? Because they didn't tap into their purpose. They're not really doing what they really want to do. They're not really happy about, about their life. Because they weren't following the sheep. They just got an average job. They got a job that pays the bills. And yeah, they paying the bills, but they're not really happy. Because that's not what the fuck you here for, dog. That's why, that's why YouTubers like us, that's why we telling you this information. That's why we trying to stick it to you, bro. So you can avoid the trap. You got what I'm saying? That's why it's called a generational curse. That's why it's called a curse, bro. Because it's stuck with you until you break it. So a lot of y'all, y'all about to, y'all about to, y'all about to reciprocate the same generational curses because you can't wake the fuck up and realize what the hell is what the hell is going on. Like I said, stop looking at it from a physical. Stop worrying about uh the damn protest. Stop worrying about COVID-19 for a second. Just take a second to just breathe. Take a second to just calm down and breathe and, and really, really analyze where the fuck you at right now. Really analyze what the fuck is going on. Okay, hold up. I don't have COVID. Think about this to yourself. You don't have COVID. You're not sick. You know what I mean? You healthy. You good, bro. You know what I'm saying? You got everything you need. Now just sit back, take a breath, meditate, go within. Get on senior attention. Get on the street. A lot of y'all, y'all should have been on, bro, y'all should have been on 90 days by now, bro. With as much time as, as some of y'all have had, you should have been on 90 days of semen retention right now. Dead ass. Some of y'all should have been on 90 days by now, bro. On some real shit. You have no excuses. You have no excuses. Stop worrying about females, bro. For those of y'all that's so worried about females, stop worrying about females, bro. Stop buying OnlyFans. Stop doing that weird shit, bro. Stop worrying about that shit, bro. Females is not going to bring you no type of shit as a man, bro. As a man, you have to focus on your purpose. You have to focus on the shit that's, 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 that's going to make sure that you straight and make sure your kid's straight, your kid's kids is straight. The shit that's going to set the foundation for under you. So that if you fall, you got something to fall back on. Because I'm going to go ahead and tell y'all right now, man. For those of y'all that don't know, no female going to pick you up when you fall back. She going to fall with you. <laughs> I'm just being real. She going to fall with you. There's a very small percentage of females that's really going to pick you up when you fall. I'm going to be real with you, bro. And right now in this time period, it's, it's, even, it's an even smaller percentage. It's an even smaller. So stop fucking worrying about females, bro. And get on your shit. Get on your shit. This is why you literally have this time right now. Do not waste it, bro. Do not waste it. The world is moving rapid. Things is moving rapid. That's why the universe is slowing shit down. That's why it's calming shit down. So you have time to put things into perspective. You have time to, you have time to think about what's going on. 
you have time to just relax real quick before shit starts picking up. So use this time wisely. Get your shit right. Don't wait till shit, shit starts picking up to start to follow the crowd, bruh. You know what I'm saying? I don't care if you 15. I don't care if you 60. I don't give a fuck how old you are, bruh. It does, I don't care about that shit. Get on your shit, my nigga. Like I told you, life is just levels. Life is just stages. If you, have, if you, if you 15 years old, you just at that level. You get what I'm saying? If you at 60 years old, you're at that level. So I don't care how old you are, bro. Figure out what the fuck you got to do to get out that level and get off that level and, and move up to the next level. This is free time, bro. And this is free game that I'm giving y'all because the, the, the niggas that run this shit, they don't want you to know this. They want you to be as distracted as possible. They want you to play games all day. They want you to watch Netflix all day. They want you to be at work seven days a week, six days a week. They want you to, do, to, to be as distracted as you possibly can. That's the goal, bruh. That's why they always constantly pushing fear down your neck. That's why they always constantly pushing fear at you. Because they want you to be as distracted as possible. Because if you're distracted, you will never figure out your power. You will never figure out your purpose. As long as you're distracted, you will constantly keep being a sheep and keep elevating their system. You going to work in a nine to five, but you're not, you're not working for yourself. You're not building anything for yourself. By the end of your career, you realize like, oh, oh shit. All I did was stack up enough money so I could I could retire. But I didn't really build anything. I didn't really I didn't really build a foundation for, for, for my family and shit. You get what I'm saying? And y'all are the chosen ones. Y'all are the chosen ones. So so this is most important for y'all. Cause it's your job. It's your job to to fucking sacrifice, bruh. And help the world. That's why you were chosen. That's why you were called on, bro. Y'all the chosen one. Y'all some of the most powerful beings on this earth, on this planet. So you really ain't got excuses. You really have no excuses, bro. For real, man. And some people, they just they just dumb. They lack the knowledge. And some people that know what they supposed to do, but they choose not to do it because either they're just scared or they're lazy. Let those people be those people, bro. Let those people stay asleep. If they want to stay asleep and that's what they want to do, let them stay asleep. They're going to come right back here, bro. They gonna reincarnate right back here, bruh. And they gonna be back here again. And then they gonna be back here again. Let those people do that. But for the chosen ones, bruh, y'all gotta wake the fuck up. For real, for real, bro. Like I said, man, this is this is gonna be one of I told you, man, this this one of the realest videos I'm ever gonna make. Because I'm passionate about this shit, bro. I see the shit that they doing. I see the shit that's going on. I see what they trying to do. And I don't fuck with it. That's why I want y'all to wake up. That's why I want y'all to. That's why I want y'all to see through this matrix, bro. See through it and do better, bro. Don't take this time for granted. I'm telling you, bro. Shit about to start kicking up real soon. Things is about to start kicking up real soon. Do not waste this time, bro. Do not waste it. All right, man. I'm out.